What is up guys and in this video we're gonna turn our Samsung Galaxy Note 3 from T-Mobile and 900T into a Galaxy S5. Yes, I'm going to turn my Samsung Galaxy Note 3 into an S5. I'm going to have all the features and the theme, everything is gonna look like a Galaxy S5 and all those stuff. So. Let's just not talk about it too much, how awesome it is, but let's just get straight to the video. So, I'll put a link down in the description for you guys to the download. Um, we're just going to go to this link. I'll put it down in the description below, and you're going to download it. It's a one gigabyte file, so it might take a while to download, depending on your internet connection. So then, once you have your file downloaded, I recommend, again... And ES File Explorer. Then go to your downloads, and right here you're gonna get your S5 RCE light S5 port. So then what you do is just copy it, and I'm gonna go over right here and find my SD card. I'm gonna make a new folder and name it S. I mean, S5. And I'm going to open it up in here. And I'm going to paste it in there. So, right here it's going to start pasting. I mean, copying it to your external SD card. So, this is going to take about 3 minutes. So, I'll be back with you guys when it's done. All right, here it's finishing up really quick. So once it's on the SD card, what you want to do is just back up all your important data and back up your important data. And then once you've backed up, make sure you have a rooted device and a TWARP recovery. So then what you want to do is just Reboot. I'm going to reboot into recovery. Mm. Here we go. Or you could just do the regular one holding the volume up, power button, and the home center button. This is too bright, so I'm going to turn it down a little bit. Right, so here you go. Once you're on this screen, you can go to wipe. Advanced wipe. You're going to wipe valve cache, system, data, internal storage, cache. Do not press the micro SD card. Or if you do not have an SD card, you could just leave it on your as internal storage and download like flash it from there then to wipe you just swipe to wipe then go back then go to install and I choose SD card right here and then go to my S5 folder that I created earlier and right here I get the RSL5 port S5 port and then select that one then swipe to confirm flash and here you go it's gonna flash the S5 ROM on my Samsung Galaxy Note 3 so let's just wait for it to Flash looks like it might take a while.
right here we go it's all finished up and then you just press reboot system and that will reboot you into your Note 3 modded as an S5. As you guys can see, you guys get the Lollipop Android 5.0. The nice sound, so here we go. It is loading, let's just give it some time. Your first boot may be a little bit long, and that is okay. It, it might take up to five minutes, four, three, it depends. So let's just wait for it to boot up. My camera for some reason going blurry. All right, so I think I'm gonna just um, pause the camera and I'll be back when it's on the setup menu and right here guys looks like we are we are setting up our galaxy s5 so press start i'm gonna connect my wi-fi later i understand no thanks okay no not now. I'm just gonna set up really quick. And here we go, guys. We are on the Galaxy S5. See, if I swipe to the right, there's the magazine. So, thank you guys for watching. And see you guys next time. I'll be doing more. I'll be doing reviews on this. So stay tuned. If you want to see. So more videos. And thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And see you guys next time. Peace out.